everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking about how to pick a college because decision day is coming up really soon. If you want to know more about what colleges I got into and how I decided to go to SJSU, I'll link to those videos in the description. But for me, it pretty much came down to two things. The first was the cost because I really didn't want to be in a lot of debt. And the second was the program and thankfully I really like SJSU's public relations program. So that ended up working out for me. But I just wanted to talk a little bit about some of the things that you might want to consider when you're picking a college. Before I get into that, I just want to congratulate all of you on getting into college. And I also want to say that you're pretty lucky to be in a situation where you get to pick your college. Some people aren't as lucky and they only get into one college and they just have to go to that college. But you have options, so that's pretty awesome. So as I said earlier, cost was a really important factor for me. And I think it should be for you as well, unless you got a full ride scholarship or your parents are willing to pay hundreds of thousands of dollars for you to go to college. I really liked a lot of the colleges that I got into, but some of them were just way too expensive and I just really I didn't want to leave college being a hundred thousand dollars in debt because financial stability is something that's really important to me so if you don't want to be in a lot of debt when you're older I would suggest crossing off colleges that would put you in a lot of debt another really important factor for me was what majors were offered at the school when I was a senior in high school I knew that I wanted to major in something relating to communications or public relations and some of the colleges that I got into didn't have those majors or didn't have really strong programs so when you're comparing the colleges really look into what programs they have to offer so make sure that the college has as your major and if you don't know what you want to major in I would suggest going to a college that has a lot of different majors because you really don't want to be in a situation where you have to transfer to another college to get the degree that you want another factor that I think is really important is the location of the college I applied and got into some colleges that were really close to where I live and some that were on the other side of the country so I was deciding if I wanted to stay in the Bay Area or if I wanted to go to the East Coast and I ultimately decided I ultimately decided to stay in the Bay Area and I and I ultimately and I ended up deciding to stay in the Bay Area because I absolutely love it here. The weather's great, the people are awesome, and I just don't think that I would be very happy in the snow and the cold. It just seems like a lot to deal with. Make sure that the college is in a city that you want to live in because that's where you're going to be living for at least the next four years. Another important thing to consider if you're planning on living on campus is to look into the dorms and what some of the housing options are because you don't want to be living in a place that you don't feel comfortable in. Basically what I'm getting at here is that I think that you should visit the college before you decide to go there. I personally visited every single college that I got into and that I was considering going to. Visiting the college will really help you get a feel for what it would be like to go there. And You'll probably be able to tell pretty quickly if that's the type of environment that you want to live in. The last thing that I want to mention, which is the most important thing that I'm going to talk about in this video, is that you need to make this decision yourself and really think about what's best for you. Don't let your family or friends pressure you into going to a school that you don't want to go to because you're going to be the one that's actually going to that school not them, unless they also happen to be considering the same college as you for whatever reason. Try to make the best decision for yourself that you possibly can. Remember that if it doesn't end up working out, you can always transfer to a different college. So I think that's pretty much everything that I wanted to say in this video. If you have any other questions, feel free to comment them down below. And if you've already been through the college decision process, comment some advice that you have for people that are going through it right now down in the comments below. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you all so much. Stay awesome and I'll see all of you very soon with a new video. Goodbye.